Hey guys, today I'm going to do some example solves using the ZZ method. So this is my first scramble. And I see I only have two edges uh, misoriented. So I can... Uh, so what I can do is I can orient them like this. And I can create my line right, like that. Uh, this and this will form a block. Well, it should, if I do it correctly. And these will make a pair. And uh, uh, I should be able to make this block like this. So this is a useful case. You just recognize it by looking at the these colors. They're all the same. And I was able to see it, see that this was going to. Uh, work out like this. Uh, this is this case is not a great case. I use this arc for it. It's not very efficient, but uh, it works. And this is uh, a soon and h prime. Okay, our second scramble. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six bad edges. So what I think I'll do is I'll do this move to uh, move this and then do this. So this is now a bad edge. And now um, I put, them, put, put all the bad edges on the front layer and do a F prime to orient them. Now I have my line here. Uh, I have that piece there, and I make the line. First thing I see is I can make this uh, pair, so I'm just going to make it and see if that works out. Okay, and my edge is here, and I can cancel into uh, that. This, uh, okay, so this has to be the well, actually, I suppose it doesn't have to be. No, uh, uh, I was just trying to see if I could deduce that it was the uh, green, red, but I'm not sure. Anyway, I would probably make, I, I would definitely make this pair first anyway, and then I would see what happens. And uh, I'd probably look down to see if this was the red, green edge, and I'd just make a pair. In this case, um, I use this alg. There's F moves in it, but it preserves EO, so that's fine. This is soon. I don't use C or L for soon cases. And J perm. Okay, this case, um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bad edges. Okay, so um, all the edges on this face are are, um, are bad, so I'll just uh, do F prime to just or orient all those, and then to orient these ones, I just do that. So I just first two moves, I moved them onto F face, and then did a F prime move. Now I do this to make the line. Uh, so this is the first pair I see, so I'll just make it. I guess that's the... no, that's the wrong edge. Okay, so um, here's the next edge anyway. Um, I guess I didn't uh, look ahead very well there. Um, now I see I can uh, build this square pretty easily. And that leaves us with two just normal F2O pairs. Let me just solve them pretty normally. This is a winter variation case, so I just do this. And I get a H perm. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right, how am I going to do this? Okay, so I'm going to do this 
to move make everything with the back layer bad then I do that to orange all of them now my bad edges are here 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 and here and I'm going to do this to move them all onto the front face uh, I don't want to do this because this is going to be um, this is th this is going to be a bit awkward to put in so I'm just going to do uh, and we'll put that on top first so I can move this to the back first and then uh, place that down uh, okay this case this is a pretty nice case you can just uh, do that and uh, it fits in can make this pair and this will join up to make a square just put that down here I can do um, CLS can skip the OLL and, uh, and that's it at an F perm. Okay, now uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, it's the best way to do this. Okay, I guess, uh, okay, I guess I'll do it this way. So I'll, so there's three bad edges on front face, so I'll do F prime. Now this is only bad edge on front face. And I have one, two, three, four bad edges, and I just put them all onto the front face like this. And then do, a, do an F move. Now here are my line pieces, and I just put them in. Uh... Okay, this seems like the best pair to do. Uh, by the way, I've made a EO cross. Um, just happened to work out that way. This uh, pair. This pair, I like to use this algorithm. It's long, but you can uh, do it really quickly. You can spam TPS on it. This case, I use this alg. This is a... Uh, Niklas um, CLL case. Yeah, I said I don't use uh, CLL for students, but uh, I guess I saw that because I was moving a bit slower than usual. But I wouldn't do that myself, uh, to be honest. This is a uh, UPerm. Actually, I would not. I would not use that UPerm to be honest uh, either. I find I do things differently when turning slowly sometimes. Um, okay, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six bad edges. Okay, so what I would do here is... Okay, so I do this, you move three bad edges around the back, do this, so this is the bad edge. And uh, so I have four bad edges now, and I just put them all onto the front face like this and do an F uh, move to uh, orient them and now I put my line on bottom and it's not... Uh, I can make EU cross pretty conveniently so I guess I'll do that why not oh and by the way I, I saw I can make this pair here by just doing that so uh, so I just adding the extra move so that the pair gets made uh, this one I'll do like this, this pair, this pair I do this, it's a pretty nice uh, alg to use for that case. Uh, for this case you can use, uh, you can do CLS, I don't know if that's the best algorithm, uh, but that's just, um, this is a commentator you can use, uh, you get a left edge term. Okay, now I have one, two, three, four. Great. Uh, okay, I guess I'll do it this way. 
So I'll move three onto. So I first move three of them onto the uh, front face. Do F two and then bring this one in. And I do F prime. So I do a F prime rather than a F so that this gets paired up. And then um, I, everything's oriented. I think yeah. Okay. <coughs> and I just. So I have my other line piece there, I just put that, this line piece in just like that. And I get E across, by the way. Um, that wasn't necessarily intended. First thing I see is this. I can make this pair like that. Then this pair. Then I can make that. And um, here's a... Uh, um, I know I'm going to get all that skip. Pretty easy, it's just like there's a headlights here and then this edge needs to go in there. Just do it this way. And then uh that's uh G perm. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so uh, there's three on this face, so if I do uh, F move, it becomes one. Now I just gather them all onto the front face, so these four, and, and put them on the front face and do a F prime move. Now I make the, the line. Um, okay, so I don't see anything great here. So, so I guess I'll just make this pair. It's the only one I can see at the moment. Okay, probably best I put the edge down first and then I make the pair. I think I think one of these edges is going to pair with this, probably. So I just do an R prime move, and if this is not the one that I need, I'll just do another move. Uh, so I can pair these up like that. This one I can cancel into the uh, triple sexy move in the back and then here do that, get a winter variation case and I do uh, uh, a perm ok so last solve uh, so one two three four five six Right, so I'm going to do this first to move three of them onto the back face. I'm going to do a B move to make this the bad edge. So now I have four bad edges are here, 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 and here. And we'll do R2, U to um, gather them on the front face, do a F move, and then. Um, do R2, L2 to make the line and make the line like that. So I do R2 to place this down. Uh, I see no reason why not to do that. And I see this, I can make this pair like this. And then this I can make like that. And I saw what this edge was. This, this is the blue orange edge. So I can pair it with this. And I can cancel into that. Okay, so this case is, uh, I do not know the CBL case, but I know the COL case. And yeah, uh, one thing that you should know about this case is that uh, like it, it doesn't affect the edges. The edges are going to stay in the exact same place as they, they were at the start of this ALG. So I can predict my, um, I can predict my PLL, just, I know that um, I know that the alg doesn't affect this block here. I know all corners are going to be solved, so this must be a U perm, and it must be the um, uh, clockwise one. So I can just go straight into it like that. Alright, so uh, thanks for watching. Um, that'll be all for today.
and uh, see you next time.